Hey everyone, so QR codes are these cool little barcodes that let you share links to any number of things or even things like your phone number or your YouTube channel, whatever, all with the ease of a little barcode. And in my other video, I walked you through how to install a QR code reader on your MacBook Air. And this is the site that I've used to create my QR codes. So once you go to scan.me, then you can create an account and what's cool about scan.me is that once you've logged in, you can create a, create a code. So let's go to website. Say that we want it to go to my classroom website and my URL. Assuming that I type it in correctly. As such. And then I hit save. Once you hit save, it's going to give you this little code on the left, which you can then download and use at your leisure. So you'll download it, it will come as a zip package, you unzip it, and then it will give you all kinds of image files, JPEGs, PNGs, you can pretty much use them for whatever you'd like to. Um, I'll just go ahead and open this so you guys get an idea as to what they are. Okay, so we get all these really cool things okay and what I like are these four down here which are a little bit smaller and uh, just to get you a preview so there's uh, one of the QR codes to my website so then I take those I print them off put a bunch of them on a piece of paper and hand it out to my kids and then they scan the apps with that other scan the QR codes with that other app that I showed you guys now what's awesome go on a dashboard on the scan.me website Okay, so then we have this list here. These are the QR codes that I've created. Now I just created this last one. It's actually a duplicate, so I'm going to go ahead and delete this one. But you'll see that I have four other ones, and these are the ones that I have on my office sign. So I have one to my classroom website that I just took you to, my email address, my phone number here at the middle school, as well as my YouTube channel where I host these videos. And what's neat is that it actually shows you how many times it's been scanned. So if you're passing out a cheat sheet to all of your kiddos with a bunch of resources that you want them to look at and you're curious as to how many of them they're actually looking at, bingo, that's what's cool about Scan.me. There are a lot of other QR code generators out there, so certainly check them out if this one doesn't work for you. But I really like having that data to track uh, their usage. So check out scan.me and then check out my other video on how to actually scan these little QR codes using your computer as opposed to a cell phone. Have a great day.